1.21 might just be the best Minecraft update. These wolves have been our longtime companion for, I believe, 13 years. Cats have 11 different color patterns they can come in, but the dogs have only had one option. That is until today, where we get eight new variations. And it's such a subtle change, but it's just so cool. But it's not just the patterns that have changed. This is not even new news at this point, but we've gotten wolf armor, so now we can armor up our friends. But now our dogs won't die in two hits. But you know what can be died is the armor itself. And oh, it just looks so good. The amount of customization with wolves has just multiplied by infinity. It looks like similar to leather armor, you can mix and match the colors to get the perfect color combo, which means you can match with your dogs. That is so cool. It's based on where you find them. So depending on the location, you'll actually get that different variation of dog. I had to travel to each of them to even show this off. But now we have nine different versions of the dog, which is awesome. Now, for the sake of science, I do kind of want to see how many hits it takes with an iron sword to kill a dog with armor. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fourteen hits! And those weren't even all crits! This is a huge buff to dogs. That's fantastic! They're actually a viable companion now, that's awesome! As soon as I heard about this snapshot, I thought I needed to actually open it, because up until this point, I hadn't actually played around with it, but... Oh my gosh, I'm glad I did. A lot of people have been complaining about the lack of features in the recent Minecraft updates, but I disagree. A lot of these subtle quality of life changes are just incredible. This is what makes Minecraft Minecraft. Every update doesn't have to be an overhaul because these little features get neglected otherwise. Not to say that these guys haven't been neglected. They, they absolutely have, but they finally have some attention and I think that's wonderful. If Minecraft were to overhaul the game with every update, not only would it just become a different game after two updates, but I feel like we wouldn't Ever get a chance to get used to the updates because they're just constantly coming out. I think the speed at which Minecraft has been updating their features is a great pace. So good job Mojang. And we have seen some revolutionary things too, like the, this copper bulb. That is an incredibly nice feature. Having one block T flip flops is just game changing for redstoners. And trial chambers add so much in the way of adventure. This is just amazing. In the last few updates, Mojang has been prioritizing quality over quantity. And I think that is a fantastic mindset to have for developing a game like this. Minecraft is a sandbox game at heart, meaning they give you the tools to create whatever you want to create. The features like the copper bulbs and the crafter and the new decorated pot features, it just fleshes out the game so much in such a small way. It allows for a ton of creativity, and I think that is a fantastic thing. I haven't even messed around with the trial chambers yet. I think I'm going to wait for the full release to mess around with this stuff. A lot of people say they add too much or too little, but I think this is just perfect. And you are right to have your opinion. You can disagree or agree with me. That's totally fine. I'm not going to judge you for it. But do keep in mind, this is a game you spent $30 on one time, and you're getting consistent updates for free. Not many games do that anymore. Up until this point, I've been purposefully avoiding this update, just so I can see it for the first time when it fully releases. Releases. And I kind of broke that streak with the wolf update. I guess I just wanted to make this video as a way to show off how excited I was for the way they've been updating the game. I'm incredibly eager to work with these new tough blocks. They look so good. Gradients just got a whole lot more detailed. And I will never complain about new textures to work with. This is just awesome. But yeah, that's really all I had to say. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in a future video. Bye bye.